Right, so I released a video a while back um, about how I changed my name to Operator Perry, or Grizz, uh, I don't know, Infinity Ward, whatever else it was, and I said I wasn't going to release a shoot. Um, well, I've sort of rethought that. I've had a, a lot of people asking me, uh, so here we are for you guys. I've got a um, tutorial ready for you now. Um, you're going to need a couple of programs. You're going to need uh, these four. They're all going to be available from my website. I'll stick the link straight in the uh, description, so just check there. Um, yeah, so let's get started. Get your profile in desktop. Um, I'm using my Elite Hacksaw account. Uh, open up Modio, which always takes an age to load on mine. I don't know why, but it does. Hmm. Shame about Cotto. Cotto's been uh, closed down, by the way, now. Modded Warfare was shut down by Activision, in case you didn't know. A uh, little bit of a hint for you there. But uh, maybe I'll release a tutorial for that a bit later as well. Um, you never know. We'll see what happens. Uh, so yeah, once you opened uh, Modio, go to Resigner, open file, and find your uh, find your profile. It's that one for me. Always pick the wrong one. There you go. That's uh, Lee Hacksaw for you. Then go to File Contents, right-click Account, and Extract File. Uh, just save it to your desktop. That should be fine. Close all of that. You don't need it anymore. So you've got uh, just uh, move those out of the way. So you've got your profile and your account. You want to click account and copy it. You want to make a second one of that. There we go. Account copy account. Uh, and you want to open Siggy which you will have downloaded of course. You want to click decrypt and select your account file. Then open almost. Open that in your hex editor. HXD you can't be that. Free best one. Right so this is where your name. You see your name there. That's your uh, that's your gamer tag for you. You can uh, you can change these to whatever you want, um, but you can't make it any longer. Um, you can't make the file size any bigger. See, this is at uh, 17C. If I was to put um, I don't know anything in there, it makes it uh, 17D, and we can't have that. We have to have it exactly the same afterwards as when we started. So um, yeah, if you've got a long name, that's good. If you've got a short name, you're kind of limited, but still, you know, just work it out with whatever you've got. Uh, so yeah, you can put basically whatever you want in here. Um, not insert, you want to overwrite. Oops, that's supposed to be a cabo in there. There you go, and fill the rest with spaces. There you go, so... Uh, still the same size, still the same length, just click save. And there you go, close that, finished. Okay, click encrypt and your account again. Go Siggy, you don't need that anymore. So then want to open all three in a hex editor. There you go, so you've got your uh, your modded account, your original account, and your profile. You want to go to your original account, the one that says copy, select all, right click in the decimals and copy. Go to your um, profile, control fi control F even for find, oops. Uh, paste that and select hex values search for it and you should get all of that selected there. So you go to your modded account file select all, copy go back to your profile and you want to click paste right and that should replace all of that with your modded account click uh, yes, save and hash block almost there you go calculate hashes, signing package done uh, and that's basically it. You need to sign it into a special way on your computer, on your computer, on your Xbox. Wow, it's late here. Sorry. Uh, so yeah, um, I'll show you that now. Okay, so once you turn your Xbox on, you want to uh, you want to have the profile, uh, the original profile on your memory card that's completely unmodded, uh, and just sign in normally with that. Um, you need to you sort of need to trick Xbox Live into thinking you're still signed in on the unmodded profile, because if you try and sign in straight on the change the game attack one, it will just uh, it will completely just it won't let you sign into live is what I'm trying to say. Uh, so yeah, once you signed in, start uh, start your game up. I'm using COD4, I think. Yeah, yeah, COD4. Uh, World at War, Forza. I don't know why you want to watch Forza, but play Forza. But anyway, yeah. Um. So that's cool. Sign it. Uh, you know, load your game up. Get to the main menu of it. Uh, and once you're there, you want to uh, unplug your memory card. And you want to switch your profile from your unchanged one to your modded one. You want to do this on your computer in uh, 
was it uh, Explorer 360 uh, and then just plug your memory card straight back in so once you plugged it back in you got your modded profile now in your memory card you want to um, press the middle Xbox button and click Y to go to the dashboard it's about now you find out if you've done it right or not and if it uh, if it's right it should say in the top right hand corner Zuger is there you go um, yeah now you're basically free to do whatever you want with it um, go wherever you want with it even uh, just remember that if you try and sign in straight onto this profile you will uh, it, it'll it'll say it's corrupt it say it won't work and you can't sign, to, stay, sign into live so you need to make sure you've got a backup somewhere of the original profile so that uh, so that you can be able to uh, get it back afterwards otherwise a lot of um, unnecessary hex editing you're gonna have to do so uh, yeah just make sure you've got that backup um, thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe